there is a feature in some of the newer Jeeps and Rams that essentially honks at you three times when leaving the vehicle if the key's in your pocket and you shut the door while it's still running. Well, we have the easiest solution on how to disable that using our Taser programmer. Let me show you how it's done. All right, so I'm gonna show you how that feature works. Uh, we're over here by our 4XE. This happens on all 4xe's as well as the 2022 Ram. So we have our Jeep here, which I'm gonna hop in. We're gonna turn on. We're gonna turn on. Okay, it's on. It's silent because it's electric. Now, as the car is running, the key is in my pocket and I'm gonna get out of the car and I'm gonna shut the door and you'll see what happens. Get out. We shut the door behind us. Honks at us. That's pretty annoying. Let me show you how we disable that with our programmer. Now we found this really interesting video from Rocky Road here on YouTube. You can check him out. We'll link his page and the video. He did a video where you can disable the three honk. It was a little more intricate. Up and get your inner fender well pulled loose. You can kind of get under here. To say the least. He was essentially taking out the horn and reconfiguring to some auxiliary buttons, which is all fine. It's a good video. You should check it out uh, to see the differences. But ours is simple plug and play go right to the menu and shut it off from there. Now this is our programmer right here. Super easy install, literally plug and play. We're gonna hop in our vehicle. This time we're in our RAM. And how we enter our taser menu is we're gonna hold down this left button right here and then our cruise cancel button. Now I only have one hand because the other hand is holding the camera. So I'm gonna put you down and show you how our menu looks. Oh, also you see we're on the audio, right? You have to be on the audio menu to enter our taser menu. So holding down the left button, hitting cancel, right here light show comes up, hit cancel again to go to live settings. Now we're gonna hit this center button right here, right? That's our okay, our select button once we're in the menu, still holding down this left button here. Let's go back in. And since we want to be in live settings, we're going to hit that center button. We can see we're on brake hold. Now to scroll through our live settings, we actually have to go back to cancel. Holding down the left button again, hit cancel until we get all the way to three kill honk. That's the name of our feature. As you can see, it's currently off. We're going to want to turn it on by hitting our center button. It's on. Watch what happens. Now the key is in my pocket, the car is running. I'm gonna get out of the car. I'm gonna shut the car behind me and shut the door behind me and watch what happens. Nothing happens. And that is how you use our programmer to disable the three honk feature, as we like to call kill three honk. Beautiful feature, our feature is a beautiful feature. Their feature is kind of an annoyance. I guess it's a safety thing in case you leave your your car and you know that somebody could just hop in. I, I don't know the reason behind it. All right, be sure to like the video, please subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay up to date for when we upload a new video. We're coming out with a bunch of different videos and our tasers have a ton of features beyond this one simple feature. So we're gonna be rolling out new videos constantly. Please leave in the comments what you'd like to see next, and thanks so much for watching. Stay tuned.